What's up, y'all? Welcome to another Dope Square the Bear sneaker review. Today, we're gonna be reviewing the Azaleas. Uh, Star Wars collaborated with Adidas and they did two different sneakers. One of the silhouettes was the NMD, but I think NMDs are played out. They're available all over the place. I feel like, yeah, they made them too available to the public, too much general releases. Um, so I went with these Azaleas. I think these stood out to me a lot more. I thought they, you know, I don't know, it just looked more unique to me. And for me, when I see sneaker collaborations, it really bugs me when I just see, um, you know, someone just say, this is a collaboration with this, but they just throw like a little pattern or a little color. But this one, it really seemed like a true authentic collaboration. This is to, comm to commemorate the new Boba Fett show that's on Disney Plus. So if y'all got a Disney Plus subscription, there you go. You know, y'all could watch it. But if you don't, borrow your friends, your moms, your uncles, your cousins, your boyfriends, your Sancho's, whatever, you know? But yeah, <laughs> so, <laughs> I haven't watched it personally, so I don't know, but this Wednesday is a season finale, so I'll definitely have to check it out. Yeah, diving into the sneaker, some parts that I really like about it, and this is a big pet peeve of mine. If you saw my Gundam review, I should have called it out, but I didn't, but, I really love when sneaker, when brands do, um, I love when brands do special boxes for their sneaker releases, for their collaborations. As you can see, this one has an actual Star Wars box. Like, it, the front of it, it kind of looks like when a spaceship takes off and like does like the hyper travel or whatever. You know, you Star Wars fans, if I got it wrong, my bad, whatever, you know? <laughs> but yeah, so. <clears throat> I really like that Adidas actually, you know, made a special box for this sneaker. And besides that, some of the interesting parts for me are the color schemes. And it seems that a, this sneaker took a lot of inspiration from Yeezys. Of course, they're owned by the same brand, which is Adidas. Or if I got that wrong, my bad, but whatever. But yeah, so I think this sneaker, on the side of the sneaker, diving into it, this material, I'm not sure what it's called, but it looks like it's some sort of neoprene. And it would make sense because right here on the side of the sneaker, it says like a deprene, kind of like neoprene. But yeah, the sneaker, it's pretty comfortable. When you put it on, it really hugs your foot and it just it feels like you're floating, you know? And I'm a big guy, I weigh like 200 plus. I'm not gonna tell you guys exactly how much cause y'all gonna clown. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, so the sneaker really hugs your foot and it's really comfortable. Uh, but yeah, the color pattern, it kind of is supposed to represent like Boba Fett's color scheme. So we look at Boba Fett, he's usually green and has like different, it's like green. And then he also has like this color accents on like, I don't know, part of his like, what do you say? Like his, uh, I don't wanna say outfit, it's not an outfit. It's like a uniform. Yeah, it's like a uniform. Thank you, DZ. <laughs> so yeah, and on Boba Fett's uniform, you usually see this color scheme. So you usually see green accents and also like, I guess this would be like a, a brownish accent. So yeah, usually see green and brown. So the front of the sneaker has like this suede material. Definitely it's white. So I have the Stussy Spiridons and I could definitely tell you that this material is not gonna last. Like it's not gonna stay clean for long. My Spiridons are pretty dirty. I'll be honest, you know, I definitely need to get those clean. But yeah, this white material is definitely not gonna last long, it's gonna get dirty. But it's, it has little perforations right here on the sides, so I'm guessing so air could come in because the rest of the sneaker doesn't really have holes. Um, so yeah, I'm guessing this is where kind of, you know, your your foot gets some air flowing through it and stuff. Uh, but yeah, di uh, diving into the rest of the front of the sneaker, so there's like little ridges here. I'm not sure what these are for. I think, um, well, there's three lines, so it's probably because Adidas, they have the three, um, the three lines, you know? Uh, but yeah, the shoelaces of the sneaker, they're not like normal laces. They're kind of, I would say like nylon or something like that. So they're very stretchy. Uh, and then the front of the sneaker just has the Adidas Azalea um, branding on it. And then the, the tongue of the sneaker is made in a, what do you say, like a, kind of a mesh material. It's very, it's very stretchy. The sneaker was definitely done for comfort. And then on the side of the sneaker, uh, I really like this color scheme. Like I said, um, you know, it's supposed to match Boba Fett. Right here on the sole of the shoe, you have, it's kind of hard, but it's kind of a, 
like a brown material. It has, I don't know, it reminds me of like the Jordan Oreos, like any Oreo iteration because the Oreos usually have like a splatter on them. And these have like a splatter of like green, white, and black. So I think this is a cool little thing that they did. Uh, and then yeah, the rest of the sneakers just kind of in this what, like white colorway. It's like kind of like, I guess you would call it like sand. And the, on the inside of the sneaker, I really like this. It's probably, you know, the only Star Wars branding that you see on the sneaker besides the box. On the insoles of the sneaker, you have Adidas and Star Wars branded uh, insoles. Uh, just on one, it says Adidas and Star Wars, and on the other, it has the actual Boba Fett spaceship. So that's a pretty cool little touch. And in terms of recommendation, to be honest with you, I got these because, you know, I like Star Wars. I'm not a diehard fan like many of you, but these really stood out to me. I just wanted to check them out in person, and, you know, it's been a while since an, an Adidas sneaker has kind of caught my eye but I was awake and then sneaker Twitter posted these. So shout out sneaker Twitter. They always post the sneakers like more than like before anyone. That's how I'm able to cop. For these, if you're a diehard Star Wars fan, I definitely recommend them. I think they're really comfortable. They look cool aesthetically and yeah, they just really go with anything. So I'm wearing green cargoes right now. I think like I put them on and they went with my fit. Uh, but for me personally, this isn't really my style. You know, I'm not really like diehard Adidas fan. So I probably wouldn't wear these, but if Adidas, you know, has different colorways, I probably would be down to, you know, keep these, but the Star Wars collaboration is cool. It's just not for me, you know? But if you're a diehard Star Wars fan, I definitely recommend picking these up. So yeah, that was another dope Square the Bear sneaker review. Once again, shout out as always, my boy JDZ behind the camera. You know, please make sure to check him out. Check out his photography, his videography, he's talented. He's obviously making these dope videos for me. So, you know, make sure to check him out. Uh, also, I stream on Twitch, twitch.tv forward slash Square the Bear. If y'all want to check me out, come talk sneakers with me. Actually, I hadn't mentioned this, but I just started a brand new podcast called the Slim Thick Podcast with my co-host uh, and friend Joseph for Tweaks. Now I might have doxed him, cut that out. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but yeah, I just started that podcast. Uh, it's called the Slim Thick Podcast on Twitch. If y'all want to check it out on my YouTube here, we're going to have videos from the podcast for now, but eventually we're going to switch over and have a, it's, it's going to have its own uh, YouTube. But yeah, make sure to check that out. Twitch.tv forward slash Slim Thick Podcast. But yeah, appreciate y'all. Thank you for being here. And uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Let me know in the comments what you think about the sneaker, what you think about the show. No spoilers. I haven't watched it. <laughs> but if y'all spoil it, I swear to God, I'm going to be pissed. <laughs> but yeah, uh, let me know what you want me to review. Appreciate y'all. Have a good one. Peace.